here we are. Got home from work. Crazy baking girl um, has asked for my assistance in making this salmon dish because she's only got one hand. She had a slight operation on one, which means she can only use one hand, so it makes it very difficult. Oh, there it is. Anyway, I'm the assistant here, but she's going to show me what to do. But I'll tell you what the ingredients are. We've got some salmon, tarragon, pepper, chicken stock cube, onion cut quite finely, salt, fine green beans with some young broccoli, grated carrot, oh an important ingredient of course is wine, and potato which will be boiled on double cream. All right guys, here we go. Let's see what mess we can make of this one. Okay, we're gonna use this sea salt to salt the salmon. Give it a bit of a covering of salt. Sea salt is always good rather than the iodized. Do a bit on this side. Rub it in a little bit. Turn it over. As this hand is now wet, I shall use this hand to put some more on here. And that's it. Beautiful. Okay, we've put some oil into a frying pan. And we're going to take the salmon and put them in, skin down, into the hot oil. And it's not too hot to start with, so it gives it a chance to heat through rather than sizzle too much. Okay, you can see that the, the salmon now is cooked halfway through, so that is usually the time to think about turning it over. So here we go. Yeah, and you can see that that side is the skin side is nicely brown on both pieces. Let me turn that over and we turn the heat off and that will now even without any more heat from underneath it will continue to cook on the other side. You don't want to overcook the salmon. Beans and broccoli into boiling water. Okay. okay. You don't want to boil them too too long. Yes, they're done now. So we should take them out of the water, put them in the bowl. Okay, into the uh, water that was used for the potatoes, we'll just put the uh, shredded cabbage. That's oh, not cabbage. Shredded carrots, sorry. <laughs> That's Completely carrots. different colour. <laughs> cabbage, you nutcase. Shredded carrots. Put them into the boiling water and let them boil for a short while. Okay, here we have another frying pan and we're going to put some butter into it. But we'll turn it on first, put some heat underneath. Put a knob, a rather not large knob of butter, into the pan. Okay, the butter has started to melt, so now we can add the chopped onions and make sure they're all out. Stir around. It's always good to cook in butter because it gets slightly hotter than normal oil. Okay, the, uh, 
the onions are softened slightly now into, in the butter. Now it's time to put some white wine into the into the mix. Hopefully it won't splash too much. There we go. Now once that's in there we have to let that boil away for a few minutes to let it reduce to about half the consistency you see now. Okay, it's been boiling away for a short while. Now we just add the stock cube so that we can make sure it breaks up and dissolves into the into the sauce. Okay, now that seems to be reduced now. As you can see, it's a bit thicker, and we can put the cream in. Give it a good stir to start with, see how much we've got. Join it up. Oh, doesn't it look nice? Here we go. The sauce is bubbling away. We'll just taste it to make sure it wants any more seasoning. Mm, I think it could do with a little bit more salt. So just put a shade more in. Give it a stir. That'll make it more unctuous. Lovely. Can't wait. What we haven't done yet is to give it a little bit of pepper to give it a bit more uh, oomph. In. and we'll follow that up with the tarragon which gives it the flavour wonderful flavour tarragon nice herb and it gives a bit of colour to the sauce as well there we go let that infuse and that will be nice. Okay, here we have the salmon. The vegetables have been nicely arranged by Crazy Baking Girl. And all I have to do is lift the salmon out of the frying pan and it will be ready to consume. There, perfect piece of salmon. Okay, all we need now is a delicious tarragon onion cream sauce. Here we go then, here's the aforementioned sauce. And all we need to cook, oh, look at that. Beautiful. Oh, that was so nice. I could eat another one. If I did, I wouldn't be able to sleep tonight. Well done to you. Mmm, crazy You're a girl. Well, hey. Yeah, but you did it though. No, I only helped. <laughs> Under an instruction. Yeah, I'm glad you enjoyed my recipe. Mmm.